This is BBC News. Here we have William Wallace, the amazing man who has, has saved Scotland from their rule under England. How are you, William? Hello, I am well. Thank you for spending your time with me. What was it like putting your life on the line for Scotland? Well, I would not say that much. The men fighting alongside me get the majority of the praise, as I was just one of those, of the men alongside them. Hmm, I wouldn't say that. Why did you end up fighting? I did it for us. And who is us? The Scots. Hmm, don't you just love it that you are considered to be a hero of the Scots at only 27 years of age? Yet again, it was not only me. It was all of the Scottish alongside me. Ah, yes, you could say that. When you say you fought for the Scots, what does that mean? We fought for our independence. So you and them and your men defeated an English army at Stirling Bridge? Correct. What was your motivation? Well, I wanted our nation to be free, and the English were never really fair to us Scots, and my father was killed by the English. All right, William. Thank you for your time. You are most welcome. Now, my, now I am moving on to a Scottish soldier who walked alongside William. Hello, how are you? Hello. First of all, what is it like fighting as alongside William? He would put everyone's life before his own. Yes, yes. He quoted, the men fighting alongside me get majority of the praise, and I was just one fighting alongside them. Would you say that this is true? I would not him, not expect him to say much else. He is such a humble man. If you did not do what you did for your nation, where do you think that you would all be now? Well, let us put it this way. If Willis Wallace did not take it into his own hands, we we could still be in trouble, and over time it would have just built up. Thank you for your time. You're welcome. And lastly, but definitely not least, a witness. Hello. Hello. May I ask what you saw at Stirling Bridge? I saw a battle, the Battle of Stirling Bridge. <laughs> and exactly what happened? It was the battle for the Scottish independence, the 11th of September, 1297. Wallace defeated the combined English forces of John Warren and 6th Earl of Surrey. So one army defeated two? Yes, exactly. You could see how much passion Wallace and the Scots had in their face, the emotion and love for their country. Especially was he led from the front. Thank you so much for your time. You're welcome. That again from BBC News. See you next week.